Hello everyone and just wanted to say how thankful we are to the Youth Cancer Trust for making Daniel an honorary ambassador and as you know Becca and I visited recently and we were able to speak to some of the ambassadors about their experiences of uh, being part of that wonderful uh, charity and if you want to know more there are uh, details at the end of the video but I hope you enjoy the following it just gives you a flavour of what they're all about so thank you. Uh, yeah, when I was going through, um, just after I had a lot of treatment, and uh, we used to have, uh, my ward was kind of every, like about six to eight of us, and we were all the same ages. And um, obviously, because we were all going through treatment and quite hard times, fun was quite limited. Um, but no, we used to have a like a pull down projector screen in the in the like the, the toy room. So we used to like, it took like it took ages to pull it down and everything. It was so old and rusty. So you had to like pull it down, find this little like projector thing. It was like a wind up, it was so old. Oh. And um, we, yeah, we used to put Dan's YouTube videos on to watch them because it, it was just, it was just, it was so funny. It just brought us a bit of like, a bit of like relief and a bit of laughs. Oh. And it was all together, like we all just bonded over it because it was just all something that we did together. Mm -hmm. And like, no, we always made a thing where if you went home and there was a new video, no one watched it until you were all back on the ward together. You didn't watch it you don't watch it without your friends mm. it was amazing it just they were so good hello everyone I'm Natalie I'm one of the youth ambassadors for the YCT um, and I'm here with two of the other lovely ambassadors as well um, I've been coming to the YCT now on and off for about eight years and I've met some amazing people while we've been here it's such a great place to come you meet loads of lovely people you get to relax you get to just not think about being on treatment and you get inspired by everybody else that's here as well the, it's hard to explain how amazing the charity is but when you're on treatment and you feel like there's nowhere else you can turn you feel so alone no matter how many people are around you it just it just makes you feel like you're in a safe place and you're not around a clinical area where the hospital is you're not having to worry about even being molly coddled at home and you just don't know where to turn when you're here you don't even need to say a word and everybody understands exactly where you're coming from it's just it is amazing activities you can do them or you don't have to the good thing with the activities is when for i joined here came here and i saw posters i thought there's no way i've got the energy to do any of that um them sports or the horse ride not any of it but this lovely lady you'll speak to next she managed to um, convince me to come along and where I thought I didn't have the energy to do a lot of things I suddenly got this burst out of nowhere and the confidence hits the roof you realize that you cannot give in you have to carry on going because if you give in that's it but if you carry on you know that you've got a bright future ahead of you and nothing will knock you down so that's me and I'll pass you over to the lovely one next to me um. I'm Eloise, um, I'm 17. I've been coming to the YCT for about two, three years now. Um, before I came here, I, I live in a very isolated area down in Devon, so I didn't really know anyone else with cancer, but it was it's so nice being able to come here and just you know, like just instantly make a connection with everyone else because everyone knows what you're going through and they understand. Uh, they, the activities are amazing. They never push you to do anything you, you can't do, even when you're like, but like, like Natalie said, your energy just comes out of nowhere, and it, it's amazing because you do stuff that you never thought you'd be able to do. Uh, so it, it's just it's such a nice place to be. It's nice to be away from just hospitals and treatments, and just nice to be like just calm and relaxed for a bit. My name's Kirsten. I've been coming here since I was 14 years old. Um, I'm one of the youth ambassadors. Um, I love coming down to the YCT house in Bournemouth because it's so relaxing, and you meet different people every single time you come down, if you want to, or you can come with the same group. I did introduce Natalie to come down many years ago, and she's been coming ever since as well, um, and we just love it. All the activities that we do are so different, you don't feel pressured into doing them. Whether you can or not, there's something to do for everybody. 